Hello my friends and welcome back to Dentures vs. Food where I try to help you learn how to eat with your dentures and learn what's possible with your dentures. Yeah, things are going to change a little bit. I can only show and discuss so many times how to bite properly with your dentures and I think that's the main struggle we all have when we get our immediate dentures. I want you to watch this short clip of my very first time eating potato chips with my dentures. This was posted on my other channel four and a half years ago. Alright, I hope you enjoyed that, and as you can see, I look a little different in that video. Um, I had just shaved off the beard and everything. But you'll notice how careful I'm being with the potato chips. And over time, potato chip, over time, you'll be able to eat just like everybody else. You'll even be able to grab a whole stack of them. Big chips, small chips. Now you'll notice in that video, that first clip, I was being real careful. I was basically breaking them off and okay. The reason I was doing that, the last time I ate a chip 20 years ago. 20 years prior to that video, I had rotten, broken teeth. And I ate a chip, and it turned sideways, and it stabbed right into one of my rotten teeth, right into the nerve. Went right through the tooth into the nerve. I couldn't get it out. It was in the tooth. It was stuck in the tooth. Big old hole in the tooth. And it went into the nerve, and my face swelled up like this. And I didn't go to the dentist. I fought with it for a long time, but I didn't go to the dentist. So over the years, I just didn't eat chips anymore because of that. There was a lot of food I didn't eat because of my rotten teeth. And I promised myself when I got my dentures that nothing was going to stand in my way of enjoying food again. I made that a point. And we all have to do that. We have to make that a point. Regular old ruffly potato chips. Hmm. I've been trying to stay away from potato chips because of my diet, but I said I'd do this video.
Look at that big old stack of chips. Look at that. Mmm. Get those things away from me, they're gonna make me fat. When I very first got my dentures, I lost a lot of weight. You can tell in that video from me eating chips. I had lost a quite a bit of weight. Because although I could eat, I was eating very little because it constantly hurt. I have to do this in every video. I have to prove to you that I'm not using adhesive in the bottom denture. And that I'm only using denture fit in the top denture. I do that just to prove a point that you can go adhesive free. If I can eat like this without adhesive, and I've showed you how shallow the trough is in my bottom denture, if I can do it, I believe everybody can do it. So the channel will be changing a little bit. I'm going to, I've done enough lessons as far as biting and chewing goes. That was my plan for the first part of the channel. Now my videos will evolve into showing you eating things in real time. And I'll steal some clips from my other videos from my other channel just like I did today. I'll steal some clips from my earlier videos when I first had my dentures so you can see the difference between then and now. Okay? So, I'll show you eating real time and I'll show you what I, when I first started learning how to eat a specific food, I'll show you the frustration or the aggravation or just how long it took me to eat something. We all go through that stage. There's nothing to fear. You will get better. Next week's video, I will show you the frustration and aggravation of learning how to eat an apple. And then I'll show you eating an apple in real time. Now, I already did the apple video in lesson 12 teaching you how to do it so you don't have to go through the aggravation and frustration that I went through. But I want you to see that aggravation that I went through when I first started eating apples. And then I want you to see just how good I am at eating apples today. I hope everybody has an amazing day. I will see you in my next video.